Hi, this is Kim with Trump is my president. Six blessings who are my children. And no, this is not a joke. It's not sunny out. It is nighttime, but I have a small slight eye infection and the light really like feels like a dagger in my eyeball. But there is something that I wanted to discuss, even though um, just ignore the sunglasses. Know that, yes, Trump is our president, okay? Um, I have been watching several black Trump supporters who are influencers on YouTube. And, you know, I love the fact that they're not just putting the race card up there as far as voting. Many of them are, but at the same time, they're looking at policies and they're looking at lack of interviews, lack of media interaction, um, lack of confirming debates with President Trump, who, by the way, goes out there to places where he is hated and he will still go in for interviews. So my suggestion is this, we all need to stay focused on this election because I don't care what the polls say, if Kamala's up 1%, that's a crock of bullshit, okay? We all know, okay? It's, it's absolutely ridiculous because she has done no interviews, she has told no one um, how she's suddenly for fracking and for protecting the border and the insurance issues, medical. So, you know, it's all based on either people are just Democrat liberals and they will only vote that way, never vote for a Republican candidate, or they are looking to have the first black, pre black female president. It would be the first female president as well. Well, we're not gonna discuss race right now because we all know she's a mix of many things and that's great, but don't play the race card, okay? And call her my sister and all that stuff. Some of you people know exactly who you are, okay? That is no reason to elect a president that's going to completely fuck over our country. Yeah, that's what she's gonna do. She has no clue how to deal with the foreign delegates. Iran and North Korea and Russia, no idea. She can't even do a flipping rally, okay? Without having weird entertainment. So I don't see how she can run our country. She's scared to death of the fallout of when she does get buried by Donald Trump. And we're gonna see that happen very soon, hopefully before August 10th, excuse me, September 10th. At the, the one that she wants to go to and the one that she's agreed to, which of course is not Fox, but Donald Trump is not scared of anything. Kamala, okay? So, sorry about the sunglasses. I know there's light. Oh my gosh. It's embarrassing, but I had to get my voice out tonight because I'm so sick, sick and tired of seeing her hide away from anything. We don't know anything that she wants to accomplish except follow in Donald Trump's footsteps, which is everything that she abandoned and was against with Joe Biden, um, she's now four, okay? So to me, that is hypocrisy at its worst. And so is she. So let's early vote, get out there and vote and, and do not ever lose hope and faith in Donald J. Trump. All right, I look like a bug, but listen, I'm serious as a heart attack. Let's stay focused, MAGA Trump, 2024. Have a great night. Bye-bye.